Now most of the MicroLogics have a DCOM mode which allows you to toggle between your application's custom settings for COM0 and the default settings for COM0. This can be very helpful when you've set COM0 to be something like Modbus, but you need to use that same port, COM0, to download a program using DF1. Now to enable DCOM, I'll start at the LCD's main menu and I'll press down four times to advanced settings and then I'll press OK. Next, I'll press down once to DCOM and press OK again. Here, we can see DCOM is currently disabled. To enable it, I'll press up and then press OK. And now you can see I get a message stating that DCOM is enabled as well as the DCOM indicator turns on. Now I'll go ahead and dismiss that message by pressing escape and then I'm going to go ahead and select DCOM again and press OK. Now I'm going to press down once and press OK to disable DCOM and then we'll see a message confirming that and we can see that the indicator for DCOM has gone off.